Daniel Mike here with his gorgeous 69 GTO, red on red, white top, four speed car, just an awesome looking car. So what's the, what's the history on this car, Mike? So this car was uh, built in April of 69 at the Pontiac factory in Michigan, and um, it was sold new to a small Ohio, southeastern Ohio dealership called Cadiz Motors, or Mike Sell Pontiac, I'm sorry, in Cadiz, Ohio, in June of 69. It sat on the lot for one year before a local gentleman actually purchased it as a new old stock. 69 GTO. He drove it as his daily driver for the first three years, from 70 to 73, for 34,000 miles on it. Then he put the Let car just in the tire back. 73 to 2005, he only drove it 10,000 miles just in the spring wow. and the summer. And then he sold it in 2005, and from 2005 until today, it's only been driven 1,000 miles. Mm. So it's got 45,000 original miles on it. Everything's completely original, as you can see, exterior, interior, vinyl top. Rally wheels, spare tire, trunk mat, engine bay, everything's numbers matching, right down to the carburetor, distributor, belts, frame air manifolds, sort of thing. Gorgeous, gorgeous. Well, it's awesome, and I love seeing it here. And uh, I love the color, color combination. It's just, it's stunning. It's awesome, isn't it? <laughs> and so we think that since it was built the fifth week of April, 69, one of the date codes on the frame says it's a 70 convertible frame. So we think that if it didn't get the white frame from the 69, that it got one of the, the 70 heavy duty frames that were supposed to go on one of the, pattern, one of the pilot cars. Mm -hmm. So you're schooling me on these because I didn't even know there were separate frames and there was a heavy duty frame. Or, or the two frame. Frame. Well, yeah, it's not like or, a, it's not unibody like the Mopar. So yeah. it's going to be a frame. That, that, you can tell because yeah, it I has know. more holes uh, in, 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 in places that the standard frame does not have. Huh. And, it's, and it's by its name, it's a heavier duty frame built for convertible. Right. So okay. you can Makes imagine sense. the heavy duty frame on this car <laughs> rides like a dream. Right. And you could order a heavy duty frame. I wonder if I wonder if you so, so if you put it on the scale with another '69 GTO, this car should weigh a little more. Probably should. In theory.